Paul is the youngest uh, musician I've ever tried to work with, and I'm really, it's really nice to see young blood and a young aspiring uh, musician with a fire in his heart. It was very funny because I had made this current incarnation of Transportarian somewhat started with him. What happened was I was sitting in the middle of the night and I was reading something and something told me like you just need to check the website when musicians looking for bands. I never go there really. So I found the advertising of, of, of a young drummer. He was just 17 I think at that moment and I thought well why don't you just try to reestablish Transportarian with the younger people. And so I just you know I mailed him and I got the demos from him and it was pretty impressive especially given the age and uh, and we went together, we played a little bit, and then we went the lockdown of, co of, of, of COVID. And after the lockdown, he emerged like a completely different musician, so much better, with a lot of jazz elements, with the fantastic grooves. And I thought, wow, that's just really impressive um, progress there. Aside from playing drums, um, Paul also plays violin. Now this is a really amazing thing about uh, a drummer playing the violin because who would expect that? And he provided some of his fantastic violin solos for some of the songs. One is a uh, single Fallen 20 that we already uh, have released and we have a music video for it. You can check um, on the link below this video. And a second song called Galian Gothic, which we will be probably making a video again prior to the uh, release date. So you can expect this to be out somewhere in September. Also provided uh, one song of that he wrote to the album, and it's it, it, it was pretty interesting. It was very sort of fusion feeling. It was really experimental, and it just fit the album like a glove. The song is called Kuznetsov, and uh, if you just check. It. I landed on the one, but it was not 